All right, here we go. Let's get our instructions here. The spirit said, watch this one. This is a cranberry full of power, ancient power, anti- Like I'm 50 years old. I don't know if God's gonna do it for me. Baby, I'm here to tell you, I don't care what your age is, God's going to do it for you. You are a part of this promise. You are a part of this prophetic word that went forth this year. I'm telling you, I've been hearing many prophets and not these little fake ones that some people be listening to. I'm talking about the ones that are really real from God. Like you can't listen to everybody, but real authentic prophets who have been declaring that this is the year of the bride. This been telling you for a while that it is dancing season and i'm telling you god just keeps saying that and reiterating that to us that it is time to dance i was sitting earlier today and i was reading a comment from a young woman and she said you know i talked to you about my wedding and you come into it and now i know who my kingdom spouse is and my kingdom spouse knows who i am i'm telling y'all Y'all better invite me to the wedding, but wedding season is among us. Like it's going to happen quicker than you know it. And so I want to give you the word that God gave me today. And that is your kingdom spouse, your kingdom marriage, I apologize, will last a lifetime. And the scripture that he gave me was Jeremiah 31. And it says, um, I'm going to read verse 12 first. They will come and shout for joy on the height of Zion. They will be radiant over the bounty of the Lord, the grain, new wine and oil, and the young flocks. Their lives will be well-watered gardens and never again will they be languish. Again, I keep trying to tell y'all that God is shifting your story. He's shifting your narrative. You are going, this, this says morning turn to joy. You are getting ready to experience the joy of the Lord. You're going to experience joy in your kingdom marriage. I know many of you have been like, yo, my, my single life, I'm just tell y'all how I say it. My single life has been a whole hot mess. I know some of y'all like these little streets is ghetto. I don't have the perfect background dating has not been easy for me i know a lot of y'all are like i'm tired of dating i'm tired of hearing about kingdom spouses i'm tired of all of this and i know it seems like you've just been in mourning where it's like i keep seeing everybody else get it when will it ever be my turn i'm telling y'all that season's coming to an end it has ended and god says they will come and shout for joy Get ready to shout for joy get ready to see god's hand on your life their life will be like well-watered gardens. Never again will they be languished. This is a promise from God. It says, then the maidens will rejoice with dancing. Y'all, this is why I keep telling you, ladies, baby, we learning how to dance in this season because we about to be, listen, we about to be dancing. You hear me? Like, get your little move together. I told y'all, I got me, I got me one of my friends, hey, Tracy, if she watching the video, she gonna teach me how to dance because baby, I'm not going to my, let me tell you something. I don't know how to dance, but, I have surrounded myself with people that know how to dance and they are going to get me right before I get married. Hey, Candace, like she already know, like we have this planned out. Okay. When y'all come to my wedding, I'm going to step a little bit. And so I say all of this to y'all because many of you, God is just preparing you in different ways, but he's saying, get ready to dance, prepare yourself mentally to know that you are going to go from thinking about it to living in it quicker than you know it. And so it says, um, rejoicing, young men and old as well. So hear me out. This is not just for the young, but this is also for the old. And so many of you who have been in this mindset of, God, will it ever happen for me? I heard a lady the other day, and she was like, I'm 50 years old. I don't know if God's going to do it for me. Baby, I'm here to tell you, I don't care what your age is. God's going to do it for you. You are a part of this promise. You are a part of this prophetic word that went forth this year. I'm telling you, I've been hearing many prophets and not these little fake ones that some people be listening to. I'm talking about the ones that are really real from God. Like you can't listen to everybody, but real authentic prophets who have been declaring that this is the year of the bride. This is the year of marriage. This is the year of kingdom unions. This is the year that you will meet your kingdom spouse. And so if you ain't heard that yet, I just want to reaffirm you that this is the year. Matter of fact, write that declaration. This is the year. And so it says, right in the comments, this is the year. I will turn their mourning into joy and give them comfort for their sorrow. It says, I will fill their souls of the priest abundantly and will fill my people with the goodness of the Lord. And I want you, 
if you feel like the Lord is going to do it, I want you to like that button right now. Hit that like button and agree with me. The Lord is doing it for all of us. We coming into agreement at this point. That is our agreement button, y'all. That's our agreement button at this point. So um, understand that God sees you, he knows you, and he's heard you. I want you to remember that he's seen you, he's heard you. He remembers you. Why? Because this is the time now. One of the things, one of the words that I keep seeing is established. And I'm telling you all, if you haven't watched the last two videos that were posted, go back and watch them. I'm not just telling y'all that just to say it. I'm telling you because God is speaking. God is establishing his people. And where you have been the laughing stock and you've been mocked, I'm telling you, this is the season where that's about to be turned, baby. It's turning. Yes, Lord. One scripture says, I will comfort them and exchange their sorrow for rejoicing. Many of you have mourned over some stuff. And God says, now you will rejoice. This will be the season. I'm telling y'all, hallelujah. This will be the season you dance. Maybe it's celebration season. I want you to write that. This is the declaration. It is my season to celebrate. Many of you have always been the ones celebrating others, but this is your season. This is your season, says the Spirit of the Lord. And you will experience God in a whole new way. There's a Nigerian song, and I feel the need to, to sing it. And it goes like this. I didn't know you would honor me this way. I didn't know you would favor me this way, Lord. I never knew that you would honor me this way. Honor me this way. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, I didn't know he would honor me this way. I didn't know he would honor us this way. We didn't know he would honor us this way. Honor us this way. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, and so I'm saying to you, we didn't know it, but now we're living in the honor of God. When I think about my life over the last eight months, I didn't know that God would honor me this way. And I'm saying this in a humble state. As you honor God, God is about to honor you for your faithfulness to him. As you served him, even when others laughed and mocked you, get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready to see God repay you. This is a That's Lord. This is the season, y'all. This is the season. This is the season. You will not leave this year without seeing the honor of God over your life. So prepare for it. Embrace it. Accept it. Because it is yours. And so I love you all. I love you guys. I just want to make this announcement again. If you have not signed up for Position for Marriage, I want you, if you want more information, to write Position for Marriage. But go ahead and sign up, y'all. This class has been changing people's lives for the better. People are getting prepared for their kingdom spouses. They are learning how to really be able to pick the right partner, what to do when God has showed you this person is your kingdom spouse, what to do once you get into a kingdom marriage. God is giving us the tools and he's literally been teaching us and shaping us and molding us, getting rid of the things that we used to think old mindsets, breaking off generational curses. There are so many things that God has been teaching us. And I want you to be a part of this next cohort. And so go ahead right now into the description box and sign up. But if you need more information, um, comment below the word class and we will get it to you. Until next time, y'all. I love you. I'm always praying for you. God bless. Bye. I did Absolute perfection.